Hello and welcome to our joint ministers conference for BUW and SWBA. I'm Mark Fairweather Tall and I am regional minister and team leader for South Wales Baptist Association. Hello, I'm Judith Morris, the General Secretary for the Baptist Union of Wales, and clearly our conference isn't going to be the same as usual. We're not under the same roof, but hopefully it'll be a great time. Our theme for this conference is Mission Out of Sabbath. The last year has thrown us from our normal routines. We've had to learn new ways of being church, constantly adapting to the changing situation and trying to work out what is right. We are so impressed with the way that churches and ministers have responded. There are exciting stories about the impact churches are having. We know, though, that these have been costly times. We're aware that many of our ministers are conducting a far higher number of funerals than usual. We know that ministers are engaged in discussions about whether to open church buildings or whether they should remain closed. Some have been hit financially and are wondering what the future holds for them. As we planned for this conference, taking these kind of things into account, we felt that there were two aspects we want to focus on. When we read the Gospels, we see that after a busy time in ministry, Jesus withdrew to pray and be still. Jesus knew his ministry had to be centred around the will of his father, and he needed to take time out to be refreshed and spend time with his father. He was modelling for us a Sabbath principle, taking time out of busy ministry to be refreshed and spend some time with his Father in heaven. It can be really hard to carve out times in the busyness of ministry, but we all need a Sabbath. We need a time to be refreshed and a time when we can focus on our own personal journey with the Lord. And we hope that this conference will provide that Sabbath opportunity for each and every one of us. And for that reason, we want to encourage you to try and make some space, not simply to join in with things as they're happening at the set times, but to try and create as much space as you possibly can to give yourself that real Sabbath opportunity. Try to resist the temptation to get drawn into normal ministry things. We know how hard it can be when everything is online and when we see the emails popping up, it's very hard to resist the temptation to have a look at what the message contains. But try to enjoy a sense of Sabbath instead. In following the example of Jesus, we see that out of Sabbath rest, he returned to ministry. The heart of our ministry calling is to help those who are disciples to grow and give those who aren't an opportunity to meet with Jesus. A changing society that's been accelerated in the face of the pandemic means that we have the same good news of the message of Jesus, but we need to discover new ways to communicate this truth, ways that take us beyond traditional church. So we hope that through some of the input, we'll, have, we'll be able to engage our minds and our hearts will be enthused so as to renew us all for the mission. Not struggling on with mission out of tiredness, but mission out of Sabbath. We hope that you enjoy the next couple of days and find them to be of value. There are just a couple of practical things that we want to make you aware of. First of all, this afternoon, we wanted to give an opportunity for you to have a conversation with one of us if you would like to. Uh, Judith, Simeon, uh, Mark, Haley, Emma and myself have set aside time so that we can have a conversation. You might have an issue you would like to just talk through with us or, um, or, or you'd like us to pray for you or, or maybe you just 
like to have a general conversation, anything like that, that's absolutely fine. If you email us, then we can arrange a time for that with you. Or alternatively, in the course of the Zoom, you can direct message us and we can get back to you that way. But we'd be very happy to have that conversation with you if you would like. Alternatively, you can link up with each other. One of the features of the Minister's Conference, of course, is about talking to people that you might not normally have a chance to connect with, or maybe having longer conversations with people you do see more often. So there's an opportunity there to connect with each other. Um, please feel free to direct message someone to see if they might like the opportunity to chat for a bit. There is space within these couple of days to spend time with each other, and that can be such an important feature of the conference. Um, extroverts get that straight away, but those who are a little more introverted might find um, some conversations helpful. We, we want to say a huge thank you to those who have worked so hard to put the conference together. There's been creativity, imagination and thorough planning. We're grateful to a number of different people who have been willing to connect and contribute in this very different way. So thank you very much for coming along. Thank you for being a part of the conference. It is going to be different, but we really hope that you'll find it helpful. Thank you. Diolch yn fawr.